Yo, what's up guys, American Mexican Gunsling. This is part two on eating healthy organic foods. Let me tell you guys something. Do you guys like fast food? Because I used to love fast food. I haven't had McDonald's in over four years. I haven't had Burger King probably more than that. I don't I don't eat any fast food foods, guys. And on top of that, it's expensive. Expensive, it's expensive, you guys. It's so pricey nowadays that the normal American cannot even afford to serve four of their family members McDonald's because it'll be up to thirty to forty dollars, you guys. It's like ten dollars a person. I'm telling you guys to avoid fast food. Make your own organic, homemade meals, you guys. Please do it. It will help. Your your body will thank you. Believe me. Oh my goodness, you guys. Like, there is so much BS happening in this country. It's not even funny. And people realize why they're so fat. Why they have diabetes. Why they have all these health conditions and problems. It's because they're past, guys. It's because they've been eating all these unhealthy foods. And if you're paying... Fast food companies so you can kill yourself slowly. What does that tell you, you guys? You shouldn't be eating their crap. You guys shouldn't be eating their food. It's it's highly dangerous, to be honest. It's very dangerous. Like, my kids haven't had McDonald's in, like, four or five years, you guys. Like, if we, like, let's just say, for example, if we're taking, like, a long trip, like, you know... If I'm going to go from Missouri to California, you know, there's some times where you can't just stop and get organic ingredients and food and make your own food because you're on the road, you know. Maybe that's when you'll get, like, fast food, you know what I'm saying? Like, I used to love eating Taco Bell, guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's so addicting, you guys. Taco Bell was so addicting. And then there's a point in my... I used to love um, five-layer burritos, but instead of beef, I would replace it with chicken and add... A, so much jalapeno creamy sauce guys because that was my favorite you guys that was my thing and in back when i was buying these these were like three two dollars a pop now they're like five dollars you guys and i'm and then i you go to the taco bell website and look at their ingredient list oh my goodness it i just stopped bro I completely cut it off my life i'm like what is this like what are they putting in the food Oh my goodness, you guys, like, like, oh my goodness, guys, this food is very dangerous, you guys. Look at, I'm rocking the Chipotle shirt. I only worked there for like three days and then I quit. Not even three days, like one day. <laughs> I worked there for one day and I quit because it was so tough. Even though like Chipotle, they say they use quality ingredients. That might be a lie, you guys, because I seen their food. <laughs> I've seen what they do. I've seen how they clean their dishes. And believe me, it's fast food food. It's not going to be... You're going to be like, oh, it's better than McDonald's. No, <laughs> bro. It's not. It's almost the same thing as eating Taco Bell. Like, you guys got to understand these things. Fast food is not good for you at all. It's not. You want to eat Chipotle? Go get the ingredients yourself at natural grocers go get it at sprouts i mean i would avoid the, the sprouts produce aisle because they spread pesticides on the produce but everything else is, is is cool you know what i'm saying like get non-gmo foods they want they have a little butterfly on it and they say non-gmo you guys get certified organic ingredients and make this stuff at home whatever you like make it at home guys make it at home it's it's a fraction of the cost. It tastes way better. And it's more healthier for your body. And it, it just gives you more health benefits, you guys. And you can add whatever ingredients you want that you love eating. Like, oh my goodness, you guys. Like, yesterday, my I wanted some pizza, you know. 
I used to love eating Domino's. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm telling you, I'm part of this, guys. I was involved in this. I am not playing around. I used to love eating Domino's. I used to love eating Pizza Hut. And those of you guys in California, me and Ed's, you know, I used to love eating that stuff, guys. But then I realized, wait, you can make your pizza at home. Why not? And we and I did. Oh my gosh, that pizza was so dang good, you guys. And you can add whatever ingredients you want onto it. You know what I'm saying? And my kids enjoyed it. They love this food. They don't be like, "Bah, I don't like it." No, they love it, you guys, and it's healthy for them. Like even when it comes to fruits, like I love strawberries. Strawberries are the bomb. Guys, if you guys don't like strawberries, but I love strawberries, and, and I always get organic strawberries, you guys. Organic bananas, organic avocados, organic apples. Everything organic, guys. I have to get it organic because it tastes way better than the generically modified stuff, you guys. If you guys don't know what GMO stands for, it stands for generically modified organisms. And GMO produce, it doesn't say it's organic. It doesn't say it's non-GMO. It's just produce, you know. Just tomatoes, onions, um, cucumbers, you know, lettuce, cabbage. You know, all those things that are produce. If, they do, if it does not say certified organic, it's not organic. It's, 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 it's generically modified, guys. And generically modified organisms are lab made. You know what I'm saying? They're lab made, you guys. They're lab made. So they they test these things in labs and then they try to figure out how they can be stronger towards pesticides and be more more resilient to growing and and have more nutrients supposedly, but I highly doubt that because a lot of people have health issues because that's all they can afford and it's and it's horrible because our economy is pretty bad about that but you guys you guys gotta completely avoid fast food i'm telling you guys avoid it at all costs if you want taco bell make it at home guys there like i said there's natural grocers sprouts there's different organic stores out there that sell organic products and non-gmo products that are good for your health why do you think these these foods are so expensive because all the people who buy these foods want to live longer and they know that's why they exist you guys the walmart is for consumers who how you say are poor you guys they're 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 they don't they can't afford the really good food if you have food stamps go to sprouts go to natural grocers buy week by week foods you guys that will last you for a whole week you know what I'm saying? And then do that because food stamps last a month and every month you get food, you get more food stamps. You get what I'm saying? So like make it count, you guys. Make it count. Don't don't be eating fast food. If you have $30, $40 to spend on fast food, save it. Buy organic ingredients and make it at home. It's more better that way for you. I'm telling you guys, these fast food corporations, they don't care about you. All they want is your money, bro. And they will sell you stuff some sludge that that's probably like just close and close to garbage guys close it's just toxic edibles that's all it is you guys and you have to understand these things i'm not telling you to scare you i'm telling you because it's obviously true it's that's a fact majority of americans nowadays are fat clumsy slow people i'm not trying to i'm not trying to get you know roast you guys but like majority of these people are fat and clumsy and slow they don't exercise enough they don't eat healthy foods they're spending it on i for example i haven't drank alcohol in two and a half years you guys i don't smoke i haven't smoked a cigarette since i was a teenager you guys like the first time i smoked a cigarette i almost barfed <laughs> like, like guys like please take care of your bodies this is a temple given to us by God. This is our temple. If someone says it's a church, I'm no, I'm going to get mad about that because no. The people make the church. The people are the temple. You are a temple. 
please take care of it. Thank you guys for watching. I'm American Mexican Gunslinger. This is my rant. See you around. Peace.